Hey everybody, it's Adam with the Mysterious Caravan. Uh, sorry it's been a while since I've posted a video. I started a new job. Um, coincidentally, I'm on, my, I'm on my lunch break at my new job. Hence the, uh, you know, cool outfit that I'm wearing. Um, but I went out to some garage sales and it was a little uh, block sale a couple miles away from my work. So this is an example of what you can find if you skip going out for lunch and go out and look for treasures instead. Um, so let me show you what I got. I found for Xbox 360 I found Fable 2 and Fable 3. Uh, it's the games and the strategy guides which I'm so excited about. Um, Fable 2 is one of my favorite games of all time so there's a high probability that I'll keep these but I paid 250 each for the sets so five dollars total if I was to sell this, I think I could probably get, if I sold them in a lot together, I could probably get $35 to $40 for them. I found this neat uh, satin, vintage satin jacket. Um, the it's It's got a federal cartridge uh, logo sewn into it there. Uh, it's like, I believe, a ammunition, like shotgun shell brand. Um, and it's cool because like the buttons have like a little I think it says birdie on it. I don't know. It's just a neat jacket. There's a little tiny stain on it, but otherwise it's in good shape. I paid a dollar for it. I'm not sure what I'm going to sell this for. I haven't researched it yet, but um, I think it would probably be easily worth $25, $30. This is just a neat little uh, tin kind of container. Um, has awesome colors on it. It's older. Um, and I can see on the bottom, if you look closely here, it says uh, made in Germany. And yeah, it's just a little kind of candy, cookie, trinket type container. Um, paid 50 cents for it, probably sell it for 15, 20 bucks. This is a vintage Home Co brand. Uh, it's a pl made of plastic. It's like a wall decoration. It's got obviously like a violin and a looks like a clarinet and a French horn and a harp. I paid five dollars for it. Um, I think I might have overpaid. Uh, it was one of those sales where I was the only one there and they didn't have very much stuff there and they were like just staring at me so I had to just kind of make a decision if I wanted to go for it or not. Um, I think the best I'll do on this is maybe 20 bucks if I'm lucky. So still make a little money off of it but it's not that great of a find. I found this Empire plastic uh, made in 1968 Santa little plastic lamp. Um, it's got the cord for it and the bulb inside. It's got his little rosy cheeks. But you can see the brand is here on the back. Empire plastic, 1968. Um, honestly, I have two or three of these at home, and I just decorate them around my house over the holidays, but. Not a super valuable thing. I paid a dollar fifty for it. If I was to sell it, if it's in working condition, maybe I could get twenty bucks for it. But they're not super rare. But I just love the style of these things, and I always pick them up when I see them. This item here might be one of my better finds of the day. Um, it's a, a vintage um, barometer, air guide barometer. Um, it has really nice fonts on it. It's kind of nautical looking it's heavy the metal on it's pretty heavy uh, and then it's got kind of a, a wood stem on it here you can see the little gauge things broke but you could just buy a new one and replace it um and it's got a neat little eagle sort of thing on top there just like the look of it um again it's not super amazing for a find but i paid 50 cents for it, and I've looked up similar items like this. I've seen sell for 35 to 45 dollars. Um, of course, this one's got that little broken piece on there, so I might want to replace that before I sell it or just mark it down a little bit. But either way, I think it'll be a good sale. Um, yeah. So, yeah, I mean, the stuff's out there to find. If you can even just dedicate 45 minutes to trying to hunt down a garage sale or two on your lunch break, you can find some cool stuff. Um, so yeah, uh, hope you guys are all doing well, um, feel free to like, comment, subscribe, start a conversation, say hi, I'm so lonely, just say hi to me please, uh, I hope that everyone's doing great out there, I hope you're finding lots of cool stuff, uh, I'll see you next time.